Is that you, Apprentice? Excellent. You've arrived safely on Balmora, I see. Now, I hope you're ready to work. I've got a good idea of where the ancient artifact is on Balmora, but it's not pleasant. What exactly does this entail? Yes, well, let's just say circumstances have changed since Tulak Horde hid his artifact. Tulak Horde hid his artifact in a vault on Balmora, one that was later converted by the Balmorans into a toxic waste storage facility. But the vault was hit badly in the last war. It's now a crater filled with toxic waste. Your artifact is at the bottom. You must have some sort of plan for how to get it, right? Regrettably, I haven't had time to put together a plan. You'll have to figure this one out yourself. But try making contact with the Imperial Resources Officer here on Balmora, Major Bessica. Bessica knows the planet, and he may even have a few good ideas. He will do whatever I say. Careful you don't alienate a potential ally. The Empire has its hands full, coping with a violent Balmoran uprising. Officially, they're a grassroots militia. Secretly, they have the Republic's full backing. I've informed Major Bessica of the Republic's involvement, so he'll be better equipped to assist you. No doubt the Republic's hounds will get in your way. I will destroy the enemies of the Empire. I expect nothing less. But the war is secondary to the artifact. Retrieve the artifact and try to be discreet. We don't want the entire Sith Order chasing our prize. There's something of great value in one of the hazard vaults. The one that was blown open. I heard you could help. Ah, who's this? Sith? And an alien at that? It's a real pleasure. I have a son on Korriban, you know. It's a tough war you're walking into. We're fixing blasters with adhesive tape. But we'll help you any way we can. Now, let's see. A blown open vault. Hmm. Uh, Captain, do we still have those pumps? Sir, if this is the vault I think it is, it won't be that easy. The fumes alone have put men in the medical center. I need to get to the bottom of that pit. We need some way to make this pit less deadly. Tell me, Captain, is there nothing that can survive the toxic waste? Well, nothing grows there, sir. But there are the colicoids. Colicoids? What do those bugs want with toxic waste? Food, sir. Our surveillance satellites have recorded them feeding on the toxic waste. We suspect they've been designed to eat it. So, uh, how do I become a colicoid? Sir? No, Captain. She's right. To get to the bottom of that pit, she'll need to become like the colicoids. There must be a way for you to take on the colicoid's resistance, so you can enter the vault. Captain, where were these creatures created? Well, I can't say for sure, but... There's a research lab not far from here that was overrun with colicoids as soon as the Balmorans abandoned it. But the colicoids are vicious creatures. Just one of them tore apart a whole squad. You call yourself an army? I'm sorry, Sith. We don't have the numbers to deal with these things. But if you can get into that lab, we'll get you into that toxic pit. Sir, even if we find out what causes this resistance, we don't have the... We'll worry about that later. Right now, our Sith friend has to get into that lab and find out what the Balmorans did to those creatures. Major, if we don't get those supply vehicles... My men are working on it, sir, but until that shipment of plasteel I requested three months ago comes in... I don't care! Tear it off the walls if you have to! 
It's not wise to keep a Sith waiting. Don't worry about the Colonel. He's loud and impatient, but we all are these days. What with the supply shortage. Now, did you manage to find anything out at the lab? Captain Ilon and I have been doing our own research, but we haven't discovered much. There were bugs, bugs, and more bugs. I hope the colicoids didn't give you too much trouble. Have a look at this, Captain. I, I can't make head or tail of it. Hmm. This confirms our suspicions. The colicoids were being mutated to clean up the waste, and it looks like the chemical mutagen they were using could theoretically work. Well, that's it. That's our solution, right? We just replicate this chemical mutagen. Um, sir, there's a problem. Our chief scientist defected to the Republic a few months back. We can't begin to replicate, let alone test the serum without him. I guess we need to undefect him. Undefect indeed. <laughs> you certainly have a way with words, Sith. The scientist's name is Yanis Tirek, and he's still on Balmora, in a Republic research base out near the Toxic Lakes. All right, Sith. It looks like you have your next objective. You find this scientist, you subdue him, my men will bring him back, and we'll get you your chance to swim in toxic waste. The Republic's going to taste blood tonight. Oh, and Sith, hurry back. I just got word that my son passed his trials on Korriban and is on his way to Balmora. I don't want you to miss him. Well, well. I should have known Bessica wouldn't let me go without a fight. But sending a Sith seems a bit like overkill. Are you here to kill me, or are you going to torture me first? Thanks for reminding me. No, no, listen, listen. I won't be scared into returning. I risked my life to come here. Being an Imperial scientist, it's a fate worse than death. Watching as I make a necklace from your entrails is another. I won't go back to that place. You don't know what it's like. We're not expected to be men. We're machines, slaving day in and day out. No intellectual freedom, no creativity. I'm tired of building killing machines. I want to do some good for humanity. I can't go back there. We'll see how you feel after this. Damn Sith! Oh! You'll have to kill me. I'll never return to the Empire willingly. I know just when to stop. Sith! Major Bessica sent us in after you to collect the scientist. Take him, but don't hurt him. Of course, we'll see you back at Sobrik. Sith, I'm sorry to interrupt you. I'm sure you're very busy. Uh, congratulations, by the way. I heard that you found our scientist. We'll whip up that serum and get you into that toxic waste pit in no time. But there's a problem, and I need your help. Just have the serum ready for me. You'll get your serum, but you need to help me. It's my son. He arrived shortly after you left for the research facility, but then he went after some holocron, he called it. A few minutes ago, I got what I think was a distress call from him. He's in trouble. He can handle himself. Look, I didn't want to have to do this, but it sounds like I have no choice. This is my son we're talking about, and if you want your serum, you'll save him. Have you forgotten who you're dealing with? I have pull in important circles, and my brother is a high-ranking Sith. You'll listen if you know what's good for you. All this time you've been running around, we've been fighting a war. I've been more than happy to help, but not at the expense of my son's life. It's your grave, Major. Save your idle threats. You won't get your serum without me. We narrowed the origin of the distress call to an abandoned building near the Republic Crater outpost. I'm guessing the Republic's captured him, which means a lot of fighting to free him. Good luck. You. You. 
The old man sent you for me, didn't he? He must have gotten my distress signal. I guess he's good for something. He kept talking about some Sith he was working with. He didn't mention you were a filthy alien. He didn't mention you were an insufferable fool. Watch your tongue, scum. Now get me out of here! Give me one good reason. My master's powerful. I'm sure you've heard of him. Lord Estrus. He won't be happy if I don't come back alive. My master sent me here for a holocron the Republic dug up some place or other. I got the holocron, now all I have to do is get out of this place. What purpose does this object serve? It's not the holocron itself that's special. The holocron's a map. It's supposed to point to a powerful weapon of the dark side that's hidden here on Balmora. The weapon's mine if I find it, which I will, now that you're here to free me. Thank you for telling me all about this lovely new toy. If you plan on taking that weapon, you're going to have to fight me first. I said stay back and don't lay a hand on me. I know what you did. We had an agent in that outpost and he reported everything. I told you you wouldn't get your serum if you didn't help. And you killed him! Don't make me kill you too. You're nothing but a cold-blooded murderer. You enjoyed killing him, didn't you? Didn't you? Don't do this to yourself. Please, just tell me one thing. Why? Why did you have to kill him? We have hollow images of the cell. The controls were right there. You could have freed him. You would have gotten your serum. Why? He had the holocron. I wanted the holocron. He didn't deserve this. He was a good boy. And I trusted you with his life. Your son was a disciple of the dark side. He knew what that meant, and he certainly wasn't a good boy. You evil, wretched, bloodthirsty, I'll kill you! I'll kill you! You'll never get your serum because I'll kill you! Sith, calm down. I've got your serum right here. Now, maybe the Major deserved what he got. Who am I to say? But there's no reason to do anything rash. I don't need a reason to kill you. Look, I see where you're coming from. I do. You have big plans, and the Major got in your way. Fine. So please don't take it the wrong way when I tell you. This plan of yours is completely insane. Did I ask for your opinion? Look, go ahead, take the serum. Take it. I made it just like this data pad specified. You're probably on the right track. The serum should give you resistance to the stuff in the blown out vault. But there's also a good chance the serum will kill you. I mean, it was designed for colicoids, not humans. Just give me the serum. Now. All right, fine. Here you go. It's only a limited number of doses, and like I said, I'd use it sparingly if I were you. 
You'll have to fight past the main Republic base to get to the vault, but seriously, whatever the Republic throws at you, the Colicoids will be worse. Thanks, Doctor. But you're no longer necessary. I see. So now you want to kill me. Go ahead. I told you before, I'm not afraid to die. <laughs> I mean, my lord. I mean, Major Irren here, sir. Got a promotion, huh? Yes, thank you. Got Major Bessig's old job. Yes, uh, as the new resources officer here on Balmora, I just wanted to apologize for the behavior of the late Major Bessica. His son's mission was not a military matter, and the Major had no right to demand your valuable time in that way. I couldn't agree more. I just hope you remember my role in helping you find what you were after. As far as you're concerned, I was never here. Yes, sir. I mean, my lord. You'll always be welcome here on Balmora, sir. A Sith is welcome wherever she goes. Absolutely. No question of it. It's a pleasure to serve. Well, uh, good luck with, with whatever it is you're doing. I found the artifact. Excellent. I trust Major Bessica was a good help. I've traced another artifact to Nar Shaddaa, but I'm still trying to locate the other two. I'll see what I can learn while you're on Nar Shaddaa. Now hurry. There can be no gain without haste. <laughs> 